Burr, it's a cold morning again. <laughs> yes. D- round, uh, what, three, four? <laughs> it's been chilly this week for sure. Yeah, and I think today was like the coldest day. Or coldest morning, I should say. Yeah, today was pretty cold. Yeah, compa- I, mean, I mean, it's there, still cold. But. Yeah, there was actually like a lot of ice on the ground. Yeah. You know, like before there's been ice, but it's like, eh, you know, like a dusting. But that's all right. Yeah, yeah. I don't mind the change from hot to cold, quite honestly. Yeah, I don't mind it either. I mean, I'm I'm more prepared for winter this year, I think. Yeah, with your big socks you got. Yeah, I got them on right now. She's all now. proud. She's like, yeah, <laughs> my big giant socks. <laughs> I got them on right now. My feet are toasty warm. My legs are a little cold because I don't have my thermals on, but... I just have a sweater on with a t-shirt and jeans. I know. Yeah. And I'm like, all right, I'm yeah, good. Yeah, and I have two sweaters on, you know. <laughs> two sweaters, a jacket, thermals, three pairs of socks. Yeah, yeah. I ain't freezing. A beanie, gloves, <laughs> yeah. And a it's face all, shield. And it's yeah. all like 55 outside. I'm a burr. <laughs> yeah, I'm frozen. <laughs> it's a blizzard out there. <laughs> no. <laughs> the plants, though. They're pretty frozen. Yeah, my broccoli is looking a little shriveled up and frozen. But it perks right back up. The sun defrosts it and my kale's doing good. Look at it. Oh, yeah, the kale's doing really good. Yeah, yeah. (laughs) My cabbage, though, I think has seen some better days. Yeah, I think your cabbage is almost done. Yeah. Which is a shame because I was looking forward to that. I know, me too. And I think the cats, like I mentioned, got in there and ate it. Cats or a raccoon or a rabbit. Maybe. You know. I can see the cats, so the cats hang out in there. I think a rabbit ate it. I don't know. Something got in there and ate it. But I don't know. The dogs are always outside, so yeah, you but would the... think. Oh, yeah. Uh, you would think a rabbit wouldn't come over here is what I'm getting at. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I thought you were going to say the dogs got in there, and mm-hmm. I was like, how? Yeah. <laughs> the only dog that could get in there would be Tank, and he can't see the... <laughs> See where he needs to go to get in there. <laughs> yeah, no, no. I think. No, it's scared the stuff away. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, so last Friday was Veterans Day. Yep. Yeah, and we uh, went to Wyatt's school performance. We forgot to mention that. Yes. Uh, On Monday. Yeah, we forgot to talk about it. <laughs> but it was a great performance. I thought. Um, it was a really cute, good performance. Yeah. Well, they had, like, all the kids, like, I think all of them, or almost all the kids from second grade and uh, third grade. It was third and fourth graders. The third and fourth? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So they were all doing, they sang, like, like eight songs or something like that. Yeah. And, and they, in the auditorium at a school, like, they went, like, all out for it. Yeah. Like, it's it was, pretty crazy. Yeah, it was really cool. They uh, obviously sang songs, and they had, like, little signs, and... They gave you guys, all the veterans, a, a little special sticker to let them, everybody know that you were yeah. a veteran. And then uh, you got like a, a cool, you know, art project from one of the kids and a little goodies bag. Get her off of there real quick. Come on. One of the cats wants to jump up here and I don't want them to knock the camera off. <laughs> but yeah, all the kids, they brought in candy from Halloween. Yeah. Right. And they all volunteered some of their own candy to put in a bag for each one of the veterans. Yeah. And that's from third and fourth graders, so that's a big deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, giving up some of your candy to a stranger. Uh, yeah, I don't. I wouldn't want to give up my candy. Yeah. <laughs> no, it, it was really cool. They had big banners, and they drew or painted pictures. We have one mm-hmm. um, that they painted for us, like a, of an eagle and stuff. It was really cool. Yeah, flag and stuff. It was nice. It was. They were all very proud. Yeah, it was a very good performance. Yeah. Yeah. I I enjoyed it. Come on, Twister. Yeah, Get got a, up here right now. Got a got a little teary eyed, you know, why it's up there. He was just so proud and just so excited for himself because he, he's been working really hard on that. And I can tell all the kids were working really hard. In, oh yeah, well he's been they were working on it for like two months. Yeah, they've been working on it for a while. And uh Obviously, it paid off because I thought it was a great performance. First, it, you know, it was cool because, um, like, I was telling Roxanne, is like, this is the first time like an elementary school that I've ever seen. Like, they like put so much effort in 
to Veterans Day. Yeah. Like, usually it's, you know, Christmas and Halloween and Thanksgiving. They go all out and decorate everywhere. Yeah. Now, you walk into the school over here on Veterans Day, it was American flags everywhere and all these coloring, like, you know, coloring book pictures that they colored of, like, soldiers and, like, yeah. you know... Um, just we love America everywhere and all this cool stuff and the whole school was like super into it Yeah Which you don't see a lot of you just don't no no, you know for Veterans Day. You just don't see a lot of it I don't know why but you don't yeah, and so when I seen that I was all man. That's really cool They really went all out. Yeah, you know and So yeah, it was a good show. It was really good. Yeah Yep, very proud. I am too and I'm sure why it was very proud of himself. Yeah. You know. We got video of it and stuff, but. Yeah. It's for us. You yeah. know, there's like all the other kids are in there and we, stuff, so. Yeah, no. And, you know, I mean, we weren't there to make a video. We just. No, no, no. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, we took yeah. some <laughs> video of it for us, you know, so we can remember it and stuff, you know. Yeah. But there's all the other kids in it, so it's not getting posted. It's nothing for that. It was just for our personal. Yeah. You know, used to have. To remember why it's singing, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Doing his little. His little thing. They all had to wear their Sunday best, right? Yeah. So everybody, all the kids were looking, you know, fresh. Yeah, had pretty you know? little dresses and nice shirts and <laughs> hair done nice. Yeah. No. That's probably why they did it in the morning. Mm. Guaranteed. Yeah. <laughs> Eight, nine-year-olds, yeah, yeah. That, their uh, hair and their shirts and everything can last the whole day. No. <laughs> looking nice, you know. Yeah. <laughs> After lunch, there was going to be food slopped all over the shirts and yeah, guaranteed. Yeah, hair I, all, the gel all wore <laughs> off in their hair, you know. It's true. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> we've been getting it in the house. Mm -hmm. Been working more on uh, the bedrooms and the bathrooms and... The house. The house yeah. and all kinds of stuff, you know. Yeah. And slowly but surely it's coming. It is. It is. It's coming along. It's so nice. I know I mention that all the time. but I wish I wish the drywall in the kitchen and living room was finished. I know, me too. You know, it kind of, I mean, <laughs> if we didn't have to hurry up and put the floors in, we would have done that before we put the floors in, but. We wanted to be in there. Yeah, we were ready to sleep in there. It was time to get out of the trailer. You know, the poor trailer over there looking all depressed. And... <laughs> I know. I need to tie up that awning so it doesn't rip. Yeah, we... I uh, tarp down over it. Yeah, I would like to go in there and do a nice, like, deep clean in the trailer. Like, scrub the walls down yeah. and, you know, get the floors nice and clean and stuff like that before we, like, close it down. No, I know. Well, there's still a bunch of stuff in there we need to get out. Like, yeah. Like my pocket knife, Wyatt's got me is in there. That three drawer, like plastic chest is in there with a bunch of yeah, like, electronic so, stuff I in mean, it. Yeah, there's still stuff in there that we we need. Not really need, but our little personal stuff that yeah. usually you keep in your bedroom. You know, there it's still inside the trailer. I did pull my Leatherman out of there. Yeah, no, I seen that. Yesterday. I want to hurry up and get that trailer cleaned and. Tied up and everything so we can move it. Yeah, it's going to look so weird over there without that trailer. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. Like, we want to... I don't know where we're going to put it. Yeah. Like, we talked about putting it over here by the pole. Mm -hmm. But that's, like, down the road, you know. But right now, I just want to get it out of my sight. Yeah, I don't want to look at it sense. anymore because it is depressing. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, I look at it like... <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> like, the way I look at it, like, and I, and I don't want this, obviously, right? But as we're... Like building yeah. and doing things, it's just how it is. Like, like I come over here and look at it, and it, it makes it look like there's junk everywhere. You guys understand? Like, like oh, it's just a pile of junk over there. Oh, there's junk over there. Oh, look at that pile of trash. I, you know? I guess yeah. You're saying it's like just another pile for things to get collected by. No, I say it looks junky. Yeah. Like it makes everywhere look. It doesn't. You'd walk up here and be like, oh man, this is so nice, except for that. Nasty old trailer that's over yeah, there with trash and it, everywhere. Yeah, and it is like right. <laughs> An eyesore. Yeah, and it's right sense. there, right? As soon yeah. as you turn that corner, it's right. It. Yeah, it's right there. And so I'm, I mean, I'll put it down by camp where the horse trailer used to be or something and then cover it up, do something. I don't know yet. Yeah. I'm trying to figure it out. <sighs> yeah, we need to, because we want to obviously tear it down, right? Put the awning back in and then clean it out and mm -hmm. then. We want to put the tarp over it so it's completely covered. Yeah, we don't want it to go to. We don't want it to get ruined. No, I don't want the right. trailer to get ruined because I'm won't. not. Yeah, I'm not sure 
what the future may hold for the trailer. Well, you know, we have it ideas. It could be like a guest bedroom, you know? Yeah, it could be a place for people to sleep. Midnight. I know, everybody. We say, you know, oh, make sure we don't bump the camera because it's on this. And, and all the cats all the cats, here. Yeah, all of a sudden they come out of the woodworks. I'm like, what? Yeah, I I'm going to come up there and knock this over. Yeah, I don't have the camera on a tripod. It's just standing up on it. And then <laughs> bump the trailer right here too hard and it's going to go flopping over. But no, with the camper, I mean, I don't, like, honestly, I don't think we are ever, at least for me, going to go camping in it. Like, that well, ain't going to happen. No, and especially now, too, because Wyatt's getting so big. Like, he's getting bigger. Like, there's nowhere for him to sleep if we were to go camping in it. No, because it used to have, like, a, a futon-style couch bed uh -huh. and the other bed. Yeah. If we had something like that in there, then yes, but... With that loft? No, that loft bed is done. It's a, it's a storage It's storage now. now, yeah. Back to where it's supposed to be. Yeah, because he's just, I mean, he's just going to keep getting bigger, right? So we can't, Yeah. we just can't do Come it on, anymore. Come on, cats. I know. You guys are, you guys are killing me today. <sighs> <laughs> cats. I know, it's like. So this, many of them here. It's like the story of our lives, you know. It seems like every time we talk, it's always about the cats. The well, cats. <laughs> there's so many of them here. I know. But yeah, I don't know. I know. <laughs> but it'll be nice. I want to, like, where are the like Roxanne's cars at? Like, right over here on the side of the house, and where the camper's at right now. I think in the future, um, it would be really nice to put like a like a carport mm -hmm. right there. I do too. Like a metal carport, because it does hail here, and you know stuff like that and I think it'd be good to protect the cars yeah just uh, well not only just from hail just you know all the weather when it's icy mm -hmm. the snow well yeah that's what I'm getting at like but yeah you know just to protect it from the sun yeah from the sun you know the heat right and we kind of planned on that spot right there to have something like that anyway yeah like we just didn't know what and yeah when, yeah when we were know. before we had the sheds here and we started doing all the gravel work that was kind of when we decided we're like, oh, this spot right here would be perfect to park our cars. Yeah, you just come right in and turn right in. Yeah. And it's kind of hard right now because the trailer's in the way for yeah. one of the, like one of the parking spots, but Well, and then I park smack dab in the middle. I know. <laughs> well, I leave my truck up here all the time because we're always going to town and picking stuff up and sometimes we need the trailer and Yeah. So I might as well just park the car or the truck right in front. Yeah. But eventually I'm not gonna be able to do that because we wanna fence a bunch of the stuff off and you know, yeah. change it a little bit. We have plans for it all, just we're not there yet. Yeah, I mean, we got a lot of plans and ideas for the future, but the house has to get done first. So obviously we're that's what there. we're working on. <laughs> we're getting there, it's very comfortable. Like in there, even though the drywall and the mudding's not done in the kitchen guys and it's all blue, like, mm. right? Like I don't feel uncomfortable in there at all. I don't walk in and be like, man, this is so ugly. I got to get this changed right now. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't seem like that to me. No. And I don't think it looks like a construction site, if that makes sense. Not anymore. Yeah. In there anymore. And it feels homey in there, even though, like you said, the walls aren't painted. The, you can see the insulation, you know. No, yeah, that's all going to change. Yeah, I'm, <clears throat> I'm fine with it. Yeah. I, I like it better than the trailer, so. <laughs> Heck yeah, what are you talking about? <laughs> Man, now having the, the refrigerator in there and all that stuff. Oh, I know. It's so, like, the first couple of days after the refrigerator was in the house, like, it was, it took me a minute to adjust to, oh, I don't have to go out to the deck, you know, to get get my coffee creamer. Dude, you know? I walked out to the deck. I think I did too, yeah. Like, grabbed my coffee, walked out, right, right past the refrigerator, walked out to the deck to go get coffee creamer. Yeah. I walked down the mall. Oh, yeah. It's <laughs> yeah, in the house. I, I probably do. <laughs> Well, there's been times, too, where I'm like, I'm going to go grab something, and I'll go down the deck, and I'm standing there, and I'm looking at, like, and I forget, like, what did I come out here for? It's in the refrigerator. It's inside. Yeah. Why am I standing out here? Freezing. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. So it's nice. It is nice. I enjoy it. I do, too. Still got a lot of work to do, like we said. Yeah. But that's, that's all right. That's okay. That's I'm happy right. nothing's freezing. Yeah, uh, if, in the freeze, the pipes aren't freezing. Yeah, the frost-free hydrant thing's working good. I did disconnect the hose like a while ago. Yeah, I seen well, some, that would freeze. Yeah, it's, uh, there was some comments on a couple of videos ago. But, you know, make sure you disconnect that hose. I did. I did yeah. do that. That probably that day. 
Yeah, and, well, and the backyard hose, like, um, I got a spigot coming off the deck. Yeah. Um, that one's disconnected from the hose right now, too. Yeah, and then uh, we do have the one in the filter house, but... That one's, like, non not in use right now. Yeah, that one's been disconnected, and obviously we don't open that no. to use it nope. right now. So, yeah, got some stuff to do today, guys, like normal. Yeah. Always busy, busy. I got some computer work to do today. Yeah. I get to go... You know, hide out in Thunderdome in the nice, you know, warm, heated air in there. <laughs> Roxanne's got some stuff to do in the house. Yeah, I got my domestic duties this morning. <clears throat> and, and other things. Yeah, other things too. What, Maura? Are you crying? So I'm feeling good today, guys. I am too. Feeling I'm good. feeling really good today. Yep. Yeah, you know, I'm looking forward to Thanksgiving. Oh, man, I can't wait. Yeah. yeah it's going to be good, guys. Yeah. I'm excited. Yeah, it's coming up <laughs> like in a week. I got one week to uh, before yep. I got to start cooking and prepping. <laughs> yep. Well, guys, I hope your vibe is as good as ours, if not better. Remember, stay motivated, guys. Yes, absolutely. Stay motivated. You guys have a great day, and we will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye.